Welcome back with another episode, Suja Driving School Trivia. Work here, Sylvia. So we're gonna we're gonna give Sylvia a chance to get ten free lessons. This is how it works. Okay. I'm gonna give you ten questions. Mm -hmm. So for each question you answer right is one free lesson. So if you answer two questions right, it's two free lessons. Three free. But mm. if you get an answer wrong, okay. you'll lose all your <laughs> right ones. However, okay. you have three lifelines so yeah three lifelines and at any point you can use your lifelines and at any point you can say i want to stop right here okay so if you answer two questions right you can you can say oh see i'm gonna go uh, i'm happy with two lessons you know what i mean yeah can you do like a little preview then what do you so mean so like let's say i answer two questions yeah. right and then can i know what the next question before is? you answer the next question decide. you can decide you have three helplines uh, sophia come on so easy. after i see the question i can yeah. decide yes after okay. see you can, you can okay. still okay. decide and say no i'm not okay. gonna go for okay. it cool. okay all the questions are just theory questions mm -hmm. just theory questions super easy you get the rules yeah. each question you answer right you get one free lesson at any point you can uh, decide i'm not gonna go for it i'm gonna stop I use the driving test success app with four in one test. So why do you feel nervous? Why do you feel nervous? Are you nervous? Yeah, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it's, 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 it's not. It's not a real test. I know, no, I know, right? I know. Okay, it's not a real test. You know. So do your best. Um, I hope you do well. I hope you get as many lessons as possible because yeah, we need this. We need yeah. this. Her test is on the 22nd of February, 2024 this year. So we really need this uh, help. It will be nice. It will be nice. Yeah. Okay. Um, we're gonna start ten questions. You ready? Mm -hmm. First question number one. Okay. You're driving on this dual carriageway. Why may you need to slow down? This dual carriageway. Okay. okay. A. There's a broken white line in the center. Mm -hmm. B. There are roadworks ahead of you. Mm -hmm. C. There are no footpaths. And D. There are solid white lines on either side. You're driving on this dual carriageway. Yep. Why may you need to slow down? A, B, C, or D? Can I use the hint? <laughs> you can't use the hint. Okay. And you can't. Uh, don't on. Uh, don't look at the at, at TikTok as well oh, because they are watching and I do. And they're, they're gonna help you. I don't wonder. Stop cheating. Stop cheating. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to say B. You have three lifelines. Okay. You're sure? If you answer this wrong. That's we it. are done. We're done. Or you can use your uh, lifeline. So you're driving this dual carriageway. Why make you? Need, why may you need to slow down? There's a broken white line in the center. There are roadworks ahead of you. There are no footpaths. There are solid white lines on either side. You can stick with B. Should I lock it in? Okay. Come. You, locked, right? you locked it in. Right. You locked it in. See, so locked it in, guys. So let me just see. Guys, is this right? D. What do you think? You can, you can, they, can, uh, they can help you right now. It's, 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 it's okay because you're locked in already. You can't change your mind. But what, what are you guys saying? Kira said road, road work to go. I think so. Um, Comfy said two hands up. I don't know why, but what do you think? Um, you're driving on the slow, uh, on this new carriageway. This is... She said B. There are road works ahead of you. And the right answer. Is B. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> One free lesson. Yay. Done. Dusted. Yes, nice. You gonna stop? You can stop here and say, "Ozzy, I'm safe. I'm done." Uh, let's see how it goes. You wanna, you wanna see how it goes? Yeah. <laughs> Question number two: Why would you fit chains to your wheels? A. To help prevent damage to the road surface. B to help prevent the brake locks. C to prevent wear to the tires. Or D to prevent skidding in deep snow. Uh, this one. So why would you fit chains to your wheels? I have an idea. Why would but you I fit might need help. <laughs> you might need help. Yeah. So let me tell you the rules again. If you get this right, okay. you're gonna go to question three. You got three, two free lessons done. Mm -hmm. If you get this wrong, um, end test, we're done. You haven't won anything. So be, play safe. You got three helplines left. Mm -hmm. Play safe. Why would you fit change on your wheels? 
Why would you do that? It could either be two. But I, my two? First Which one thought, are you thinking my about? My first one is to help prevent skidding in deep snow. That's your first one? Yeah. Or now I'm thinking about to help prevent the brakes from locking. Because chains and damaging the surface, that doesn't... Yeah. And this wear is... and tear with your tyres. Mm, not too sure about those ones. So, so you're gonna guess this or? I'm going to ask for help. You're gonna ask for help, so you're gonna use one of your helplines? Yes. She's gonna use one of her <laughs> helplines, okay, which one? Safe. Which one are you gonna use? You got the 50-50, mm -hmm. you got uh, call a friend. If you would call a friend, who would you call anyways? Karen. Karen? Yeah. Why? Karen knows everything? Of course, Karen, they know everything. <laughs> Karen, you're gonna call Karen? I would call her. Why, who is Karen? Karen's my friend. And she knows everything. She, no, she's she doesn't like, know everything, but she's got a good head on her shoulders. Okay, she's got a good head on. So you're going to call Karen. Um, <laughs> sounds weird, Karen. No, but she's <laughs> not a Karen. She's, okay, okay. Her name okay. is Karen. Karen. I know, it's not a Karen. Guys. <laughs> no, okay. Um, or the, the last one is um, you can ask for the help of the mm -hmm. audience. Audience, yeah. So which one would you want to choose? I think I'm going to ask the audience. You're going to ask the audience? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Guys, we need your help right now. We need your help. Uh, why would you fit chains to your wheels? To help prevent damage, A. B. To prevent brakes from locking. C. To help uh, prevent wearing the tires. Or D. To help prevent skidding in snow. Mm. Kira said snow. Mm. What else? What's everyone else saying? Kira, snow could be right. Um, HED said D. D. That snow again. Snow again. Yeah. So we got the second person. You know what? These people like are uh, genuine people. Yeah. They're not fake. They're not. They're not AIs. <laughs> you didn't just plot them not, there. No, they're just not okay, there. Not it's box. just like genuine people, and yeah. they are subscribers. So they are like they they will not be like giving you the right answers. They they, lo they love they will love watching you basically. So <laughs> uh, I didn't hear the question, question, but I just say D. Uh, Lydia, that's <laughs> not really helpful. That's not helpful. Um, let me quickly uh, quickly read the question. Why would you fit chains on your wheels? Uh, a to help prevent damage to road surface. Would that it prevent doesn't make sense. It? Uh, B to help prevent the brakes locking. D to prevent uh, wear uh, to the tires. To prevent wear to tires. Or D to prevent skidding in deep snow. HD said again. Prevent. Yeah, I did was you, thinking that. As well. Did you Google it quickly? Google it quickly, man. Yeah, Come on, guys. Up, just out. Come on, Google it. You can Google it quickly. Um, are you gonna lock it here or are you gonna wait a little bit longer? Okay, Lydia, Lydia said definitely D. said D. Okay. She passed the driving test, by the way. Lydia, congratulations. So Lydia everyone's going for D. I'm going to go with D. Promise, and that was promise. Awesome. Kira said promise, it's D. Okay. Uh, Christian said D. Okay, we got this, We're gonna guys. go, we yeah, got this. Go. We're gonna go D. <laughs> We're gonna go for D. And the answer was... <laughs> Yay, thank you guys. Thank you guys, amazing. You guys are... <laughs> If, let me just quickly turn the camera around. I, I can't, I can't. I even, oh, can't even okay. turn the camera around. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Can't turn the camera around. But yeah, I can do this. There you go. Thank there you, you go. Guys. Yeah. <laughs> Lydia, everyone, HED, uh, thank you so much. You helped her with the third free. The third. Second, the second question, question, right? Yeah. So we got, so two, got two free, free lessons. lessons. Two yeah. free lessons. Um, I'm gonna ask you every single time anyways do you want to stop here and and say I want to take two free lessons or you want to carry on with the third question okay what um, do you want to do well you said I can hear the you question, can see the question first wait. okay but you still have two helplines uh Sylvia oh yeah we're definitely going Let's we're definitely go. going yeah where's the safest place to park your vehicle at night a near a red route you know where the red route is a lot of people know this no, no I don't actually do you know where the red route is um B on a busy road. C in a garage. I think I might have been a bit too close. Or D in a quiet car park. Oh, I should know this. You should know this. This is this you should know this. Where is the safest place to park your vehicle at night? A near a red road. B on a busy road. C in a garage. D in a quiet car park. So what do you guys think? The red route. What's the red route? I don't know, but it's not. It's it. not the red route, but I don't know what red route, but it's not red route. Okay, it's not red fair route. enough. On a busy road. Mm -hmm. The safest. The safest. safest. A garage is safe, but does everyone have a garage? 
garage. And what's the garage? Is uh, it the one that opens and you can put your car that's in? That's a garage. That yes. is that's a safe That is a garage. We call that a garage. A, ca- a, ca- <laughs> a quiet car park. A quiet car park. That does sound sensible as well, but is there security? Is there cameras? Yeah. Uh, so what do you think? I reckon a garage. Garage? Park. Okay, those two quiet car park or a garage. So you are confused, you are thinking but about if, quiet. If it's car- quiet, then yeah. do you think it's safe? No, because you don't know if there's cameras or security. So, uh, that is so a garage. Garage? garage, are you gonna lock it? Yes, you you got two half lines left. You want to lock it? Okay, we locked it on the garage. We ah! locked it on the garage. So, but let me just ask everyone else first. C, that's what the HD said. Uh, Kira said 1000 million percent said C. So, uh, C. I trust your judgment. You said Gareth anyway, you can't change it anyways. Ah, yeah, yeah, that's true. She said C, and let's see if it's right. Yeah, you know what? Red route is, it's, you know, in London they have like one of these roads uh, where you can not park at all. Like, Red route is like a, has a red, mar- a red line, oh, it gives you tickets to everywhere. On a busy road, um, no, because no. it will make it dangerous maybe. Yeah. In a garage, I think that's safe. Your home garage, do you think yeah. it's the safest place? No, a quiet car park, do you think it's safe Not when it's really quiet? Depends. No, it's if it's quiet, nobody's there. That means like thieves can come and yeah. stuff. Like, let me see, is the question is right? Question number three, do we have an answer? Ah. And it's right, ah. let's go. Sylvia, you overthink. The options way too much. I that's know. what Lydia I said. Know, I know. Lydia said you're to overthink way too much. <laughs> Well done! Three free lessons. You want to stop here or you're going to carry on with question number four? You want to see question number yeah, four first? Question number four. You're carrying two 13 year old children and their parents in your car. And their parents in your car. Who's responsible for seeing that the children wear seat belts? A. You, the driver? Yeah. B. The children's parents? No. C. The children? No. Or D. The front passenger? Definitely A. I'm not gonna overthink it. It's definitely, definitely A. a. Yeah. Okay, if you get this right, mm-hmm. you're gonna go to question five, four, three lessons done. If you get this wrong, you lose all your free lessons, man. Oh my god. You're gonna lose you're all not, your free you lessons. Can give me like one life back. No, I can't give you one life back at all. Okay. You've got two more five. helplines. Go hard or go home. Let's do it. A. Yeah? yeah. Go hard to go home. Okay, let's go. A. She's gonna go for A. Uh, she's gonna lock it in. What do you guys think? A, Kira the driver, HD driver, Christian said the driver. Yes, uh, they all said the driver. Yeah. Let's see if this is right. Come on. iPad, can we have an answer, please? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> so I've got four hours. Oh, this, I like Sylvia. this. Sylvia, you're doing well. Um, <laughs> Sylvia, I got a banana here. Do you want a banana? Uh, it's, yes, it's, please. I, I, like I think it's definitely out of date. That's banana for bar. banana bread. You can make banana bread. This, this banana's out but of date, good. but it, it gives you energy for a driving test. It gives you energy for a driving test. No, you sure? Well, and I, I think, it's going I, to be too sweet. I, I think you shouldn't eat this one. We can make banana sweet. bread out of that. this. Yeah. But you're not gonna do it, so just chuck it. That was so random, Ozzy. I've got a banana. <laughs> Now you know what I seen some I seen some banana. Energy yeah. boost. I've been there for what a while. What about sweets? No sweets today. No sweets. Um, no. no sweets today. No. Uh, maybe on that side. No. I've got no sweets no, today. Uh, no sweets no, today. I normally have. There, one day I want sweets. I know. Also, you I, don't yeah, have yeah, you're right. Like I, I'm gonna bring sweets next time. Okay. Next time we're gonna Let's bring some sweets. Okay. Question number five. Okay. Let's uh, do it. Got two helplines left. Okay. Gonna call question number five. You're driving at night with your headlights on main beam. A vehicle has overtaken you. When should you dip your headlights? A. As soon as the vehicle passes you. B. Before the vehicle starts to pass you. C. Sometime after the vehicle passes you. Or D. Only if the other drivers dip their headlights. This one's hard. This one's a bit tricky. This one's hard. Not for me, but. I'm not gonna call Karen. For this you're not gonna go. No. You're not gonna use a hotline for this one. <laughs> not for Karen. No? She would just be like, "Girl, not gonna, I don't she's know." She's not gonna call Karen. She's not gonna call Karen. Um, taking you. When yeah. should you dip your headlights? Right. I'm thinking either. Yeah. As <sighs> a B. If you do it before, then they might not be able to see, but then their headlights will be on, wouldn't they? 
yeah, it could be like you I should, mean, you I, should I don't really. Yeah. Drivers. You should you shouldn't dazzle drivers definitely. But which one are you thinking like? Oh, it might be this or that. Which one do you think like? Okay, I'm, I'm hesitating between those two. I feel like A. A. So as soon as the vehicle passes you. Yeah, that would be the appropriate time. Okay. Or. Or. Anything else you think like oh, I'm gonna I'm hesitating between those two. Which one is Is overtaking you, so they're already doing it. While, while, so while overtaking or as soon as they pass you? So I think some, while. Before the vehicle starts to pass you, sometime after they pass you, or only if the other vehicle did the headlights. So this, D is not the right answer. You, no, it's not. I didn't D have that also, in my okay. mind. That's what you say, okay? Yeah. These, these out, you, you cancel D out. So you got A, B, C left. You're driving at night with your headlights on the main beam. A vehicles overtaking you. When should you do that? I think it's A. A. You're not going to use your helpline? What's my other helpline? 50 50. 50 50. I feel like four hours is a lot to lose. Four so hours maybe is a I lot should to use lose. It's a, a lot to lose. Not Karen, so the 50 50. Can you're going to use the 50 50? Yeah. Okay. But I think it's The 50 50 A. is C and D disappeared. A and B are still available. The so C and, D. C and D are gone. So, so it could also I'm be a go gone. It could only be A and B. Before we, as soon as I'm gonna stick with A then. She's gonna stick with A. Hey, if you get this right, hey, if you get this right, <laughs> you're gonna uh, go to question six. Mm -hmm. If you get this wrong, you're gonna go. You're gonna oh, go home with nothing. God. You're gonna go home with nothing. Home with nothing. We, need those three, we need those three lessons, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, I can't. Um, she said, answer A. As soon as the vehicle passes you. As soon as the vehicle passes you. What do you guys think? She locked it already. Um, Kira said, A, 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 don't overthink. <laughs> okay. That's what Kira said. Um, Christian said, A. Uh, don't ask about the start of the motorway, though. <laughs> No, those ones. Uh, uh, hey, said, I think A. Mm -hmm. <sighs> if you get this right, you can use another helpline. Are you, you one of the helplines? Is no, I can't. No, I'm not, I'm not one of the helplines. You can't use me as a helpline. You can't use me as a helpline. I'm not one of the Come helplines. Come on. No, I can't be a helpline. No. Too bad. So, what do you think it is? I think it's A because that was my first gut instinct. So, you've a. Got to you locked it, trust a. your gut instinct. You locked it, A. You don't want to use a helpline. No. We're going to go for answer A. A, B, C, or D, everyone says A on, on, on technical as well, they say A. And you went for A. As soon as the vehicle passes you. And let me see if the answer is correct. And the answer was correct! Oh my god! You know what, yeah? That you was, know what, yeah? Oh. That was really, really close. I was like, I know! <laughs> are you crying? Are you crying? I, I would have <laughs> cried if I lost my four hours. <laughs> Oh my days, five free lessons. Thank you guys. You guys are good. You guys are good. I hope you're not cheating. I hope you're not cheating, but you're good. You're good. Um, but yeah, we have Sylvia. She just won five free lessons so far. So far. I'm going to ask you again. You can go ask question number six or you can go here home with five free lessons. It's risky, isn't it? It's risky. You have still one helpline left. Yeah. Uh, the questions are gonna get harder right now. Um, so what do you want to do? Let's see the question first. The question six. Mm -hmm. Question six. You're the first person to arrive at an accident mm -hmm. where people are badly injured. Mm -hmm. You've switched on your hazard warning lights and checked all engines are stopped. Mm -hmm. What else should you do? A. Move to the people who are injured, clear their vehicles. No. B. Try and get people who are injured to drink something. No. Make uh, C, make sure that the ambulance has been called. Possibly. Or D, stop other cars and ask drivers for help. But if I use my If you judgment, use your judgment. I would say it would be C. C, make sure that the ambulance has been called. Yeah, because you can't move them in case you injure them even more. And then try and get people who are injured to know. Don't know the try, try to get people who are in to drink something. No, uh, that's, that's definitely out of there. Yeah. yeah. So those two ones, I would say no. Which Stop one? The other cars people and injured vehicle cars. So those two, A and B, are definitely out. I think six, D is out as well. 
so this I all? C. Make sure that the ambulance has been called. You're the first person to arrive. Yeah. Oh, but then we need to warn of the traffic as well, don't we? Yeah. But what I mean, gives you the right to stop other cars? I can't. I can't really say much. I can't really say much because yeah, I, I can't. But um. I think for safety reasons. What? Yeah. You will stop other cars and say, "Help me." It's a hazard, so you need to let them know that there's a hazard, and you're the first person. So, C or D? And you don't want to use the la last half one. You want to call Karen? Karen? Yeah. She's going to use a lifeline, guys. Which one are you, which one are you thinking? Put it in a loudspeaker, please. Put it in a loudspeaker. And you okay, have. Hopefully, um, she doesn't start talking about some random stuff. You have one minute as well for, the, uh, for that. Hello? Hi, Karen. The I'm timer fine. starts. Be quick. Okay, sorry. Sorry. Oh, by the way, happy birthday to Amara. <laughs> okay. Um, we're all live on YouTube, but I need your help. <laughs> okay. Why is speaker, it so low? I, for, it for, is. For louder. This is the loudest. I don't know why. And you're could we're you echoing. Could... Anyways, can you hear me? Okay. So, quick uh, theory test question. Can you help me with the answer? Right. Right. So you're the first person to arrive at an incident where people are badly injured. You've switched on your hazard warning lights and checked all engines are stopped. What else should you do? So you've got A, move the people who are injured clear off their vehicles. Try and get people who are injured to drink something. Make sure that an ambulance has been called or stop other cars and ask the drivers for help. Well, yeah, that's what she I was said thinking. C or D. C or D, yeah. She thinks C. She thinks C. C. Karen, I'm going to lose my... I've got like five five hours free. So I need to get this question right. C, why? What's your final answer? Is that your final answer? Yeah, because you told me to call the ambulance. Okay, we have okay. to end the call. Oh. Thank you. Thank you, Karen. Okay, Thank you. thanks, Karen. I'll call you later. She said C, but she wasn't really sure. She says C because you've got to make sure that the ambulance, ambulance is called, yeah. But, but what I about the traffic though? I think, to be honest, I said C, so hey. You're gonna go for it. If you got this right. She's going to have to pay for my lessons now if I get this wrong. If you get this wrong, Karen, has, you, have to pay, Karen you have to pay for the lessons. If you get this right, you get six free lessons. If you get this wrong, um, you're out of the game, you won zero. Mm. You're gonna win home with zero, and we really need this lesson. Oh my god. And I can't help you more than this. Like, you see, go, you're gonna lock in? Yeah, go on. She locked it in. Let me just see what everyone else is saying. First thing I read is HED said, warn other drivers. That's, he said, fingers crossed. Kira said, definitely see. Christian said, see. Uh, HDC, I'm gonna go again. I don't know. Let me reload the app. <laughs> um, Kira definitely said C. Yeah. Everyone's, uh, uh, most viewers have seen that was my first instinct. That was your first instinct. Yeah, Karen, um, confirmed, Karen confirmed, it. confirmed it. Viewers confirmed it. The viewers confirmed it. It cannot, it can only be C. Oh, at this me. Unless we all need to revise our theory. We need to revise our theory. You know, as he passed that theory like eight months ago. But you forget, you know, you forget you your theory, you know. Like, see, you don't your theory, you pass. 50 questions. 50 oh, questions, uh, yeah. <laughs> Smart. Even the, even the ACD, he passes the th theory. He, he's, he can actually watch, like, he just like, he still doesn't know. Okay, well, let's go. We're gonna go for answers. But he's the only one who said D, so let's see. He said D, C, D first, oh, and now he's, he's in doubt as well. Okay. Come on, go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go for We're gonna go for C. Come on. And the answer Come on. is. Is, 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 can we have an answer? Yeah! Oh my god! Yay! Yes, oh my god! That was Thank amazing! Oh. Amazing! Gosh, Question six, right? Um, we got three more questions to go and then you want 10 free lessons. Mm. That's the end of the game. If you do three more questions left, it's not much. Three more! <laughs> the risk is getting bigger. Getting but no helplines. You have no helplines, use all your helplines. Yeah.
dumb, dumb. Eh, question okay, number seven. Play safe though. Okay, go on. Let's see. What still is still play safe? Mm. Question number seven. You can see the question first. Mm -hmm. You can say after this question, I'm gonna stop here, yeah. or you can say, okay, I'm gonna play on, and go for ten hours. Ten hours is nice. Imagine ten free lessons, Sylvia. You know how much it costs, by the way. Let me just quickly. About, it costs about, a, about, a about bit. four hundred pounds. That's so a lot. Like, about four hundred pounds. Yeah. So, okay. Question number seven. What would you do if you see older people crossing on road ahead? This sign here. A. Tap the hole in case they they yeah, hard to fall. That's rude. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Tap the hole. A. B. Oh, yeah. Wave at them and cross that they are, uh, have been seen. No. C. Be patient and allow, allow them to cross on their own time. C. What going? And D. Rev the engine like. Vroom, vroom, vroom. <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this one is easy. <laughs> yeah. C. C. No, you know we've been thinking about it. Pro, it's close to your next question. Yeah. You sure? Let me see if that's right. Computer, can we have an answer? And it, it was. Right. Everyone said C as well. And <laughs> This. We got this. Question number eight. Seven uh, lessons secured. You yeah. can go home with seven of them. If you want to carry on, you can carry on. Okay. Question number eight. What does it mean if you see a pedestrian with a dog and has a yellow or oh. burgundy coat? Oh, this one is difficult. It's tricky because of the colors. With this one burgundy is difficult. Coat. Um, what, what's gone? Burgundy coat. A. The pedestrian is a dog trainer. No. B. The pedestrian is colorblind. C. The pedestrian is deaf. Or D. The pedestrian is older person. I A. think it's between those two, B Which, and C. B and C. Yeah. So you got seven free lessons secured. If you go, ho if you say stop now, you can go home at seven. Mm. If you carry on and you get this answer wrong, you lose everything. You lose everything. I think it might be. B, but I, I, I'm not playing. I'm going to end this there. Keep my seven hours free. So you're you don't wanna. You, you're I've gonna got no like unless I've got one more lifeline, no. Yeah. So you you don't know this question. You, you're like I, I'm you? I'm between. Um, you're, you're between. C and no B and C. B but and C. I don't wanna lose my seven hours free lessons. So yeah, I'm gonna end it there, please. <laughs> so are you sure? I'm gonna ask yes. you three times. Oh. Are you sure? You're not gonna give an answer, so you wanna go home with seven free lessons. You could get three more. Maybe the next question is gonna be super easy. We don't know. Or maybe it's going um, to be very hard. So we so we so we asked like no we can't ask, we can't ask you because they're gonna give answers we don't wanna do that. Um But I don't want to wanna... lose my point, my hours. Yeah, no, hundred percent. So would you say to, would you say sorry I'm gonna I'm gonna stop here? Hundred percent sure. Keep my hours. Yeah. Hundred percent sure. It's been fun. It's been fun. It's been She's real, gonna stop here, I'm guys. Gonna stop here. <laughs> I don't like. She's to gonna lose stop here. Like well that. done. Well done. <laughs> Seven free lessons. Good, that's, that, that's a lot. That's a lot. Seven free lessons. It's yeah. good. It's good. She's gonna <laughs> stop here, guys. She stopped. But if you had to answer. Yeah. And you, you, what would your gut say? What would you answer right now? If you think like, okay, I have to carry on. What? Well, one, the B and C, you said. Yeah, because they have a dog and a coat. Yellow, so which burgundy. answer would you go for? Which answer would have gone? Would you have gone for? If um, you would have carry on. I would say probably C because C. if it's B, they can still hear. But then yeah. the dog, I guess, would help them out. But this, so, so pedestrian is deaf. I You're gonna go for so. C. Yeah, but I, you yeah, know, yeah, yeah, just yeah, to yeah, find out yeah, what it was. Yeah, yeah, just to find out, we're gonna find out <laughs> what it was. It she said, she, she would have, she would have gave a, a C as an answer, which is pedestrian crossing. Sorry, the pedestrian, pedestrian crossing. But you need to pedestrian hear the is deaf. Well. But then, if you can see though, why would you need a dog and I don't know. So C Tricky. would have said C. Let me see if this is right. And C was correct. Oh, oh, oh my oh, God! Oh, was it Kira who said no? It was oh, Sylvia. It would have been right, oh, Dev Christian. I had eight hours. Eight, whole eight hours. hours. And then uh, let me see the next question. Oh. Question nine would have been: What should you do when you park car facing downhill? Uh, 
park close to the bumper for uh, of another car, park with two wheels on the curb, turn the wheel steering towards the curb, or uh, D, turn the steering wheel from the curb. That was uh, that would have been the, the ninth question. Towards the curb. Towards the curb again. Oh, she was right again. Oh my God. <laughs> so that would have been eight free lessons. Oh, and question number be, ten. Yeah. Question number ten was which sign can't shows you give that. Can you to me anyway? No, I can't. I can't. I've answered I can't. Them I can't. I can't. Um, question number ten would be which sign shows that the tanker is carrying a dangerous goods. This one over here. And um, what answer would you give? Uh, give uh, this dangerous goods. No, you'll be. This one yeah. would have been correct. <laughs> and look at this. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Oh, it was fun. Though. It was good. It was good. And like a big a applause, big applause to okay. Sylvia. It was, thank you guys. And thank you very much, guys. That was that was that was amazing. Karen was very helpful. Yeah. Thank you, Karen. If you're watching this, this video is gonna come out on YouTube. And for the people who have not seen the video, we do this all the time with a, a lot of other learners. Yeah. It'll be fun. We're gonna see this out. We're gonna see you guys soon. Make sure you like, subscribe, and yeah. Thank you. We guys. had Sylvia today. <laughs>